If you guys are looking for cheap, fast, and reliable Madden NFL 21 coins, head over to my sponsor, EasyMutt.com, and use code MONTY for 5% off at checkout. Links in the description below. Enjoy. What is going on, YouTube? And welcome back to another Madden 21 Ultimate Team video. And guys, in this video today, we are going to be going over the market, best training, the best players, what players to buy, sell, invest. We're going to be going all over that. But before we get started, guys, please, please, please listen to this, man. We are doing a pack opening on the channel, on stream, on YouTube at 2 p.m. Eastern time. So be there, be square. Let's get it. And a 100K giveaway every single Monday, man. So comment 100K down below to enter that giveaway, man. So uh, you got to be subscribed. You got to smash that like button. You got to comment 100K on any video you'd like to enter the giveaway. So guys, um, market talk, man. We're going to be going over the best training. I mean, we just got new Ultimate Legends, the best training, the best players to buy, what players to buy, what players to not buy. Um um investments buy or sell basically everything so let's get into it man uh we got three new ultimate legends jari evans uh we got uh, we got another uh, we got um carl banks that's who it was carl banks and brett Favre. so we're gonna start with the 98s we're gonna start with players that you could possibly buy i'm gonna tell you guys right now jalen smith drew Brees, buyable Baker Mayfield, Bible. Guys, you can make a team off of these LTDs. Like, I am serious when I say that. This Jari Evans will be a lot cheaper in a few hours, if I'm being honest. Maybe a few days, if I'm even, uh, if I'm a little over-exaggerating. Maybe a few days, I would say, probably. But these cards are really cheap. I mean, 98 overall for 300k. You can get a 96 for, like, two, yeah, 200 and 200 plus k. I mean, come on. I mean, a 96 or a 98 for 100 plus K. I mean, I'm going with the 9. Like, ja like think about it. Jari Evans is going to be around 300K, right? So 300K, Jari Evans, or 200K, Brandon Shreve. I mean, I that speaks for itself. Honestly, guys, if you if you need a squad, go for the 98s. Go for the Drew Brees. Go for the Jalen Smith. Maybe even the Baker Mayfield if you rather him. Baker Mayfield, honestly, uh, he's pretty good. So Baker Mayfield, you can go for... I wouldn't go for anybody else, though. Those three I would specifically go for because they are very cheap, if I'm being honest. And guys, if you want a team diamonds, like I told you guys, go and do the set you or the um the what's it called? You guys want to make some coins? Go and watch my coin method from yesterday. You can make a sheesh ton of coins. I almost cursed right there, but I'm not going to. But you can make a lot of coins, man. Um Go and watch that video. So 98s are viable depending on the price. I would stay in the 300 to 400k. You know what? 300 to 500k range for a 98 overall. These probably will drop soon. And uh, that's the reason I'm saying in that range. I wouldn't go any above that. So any of those are fine. And now, like I said, to 96s. 96s are viable because they have not moved in months. And uh, if I'm being honest, certain cards, you gotta look out for the stats, man. <clears throat> look out for the stats. Jermichael Finley, great card. <clears throat> Sorry, boys. Jermichael Finley, great card. Jamal Adams, great card. Vic, he's a good card. He, he sells sometimes, but he's a great card. Anthony Costanzo, like, I, I've never seen this card. Like, I have it. I don't remember it. Like, this card is, is a no-no. A 92 power block and a 96 overall. I mean, a uh, pass block, not good at all. So, like, he's not a good card you want to get. Like... Darren Waller's a good card. Michael Strahan's a good card. Um, a lot of these cards are good. I'm not going to go over a lot of people, but make sure you look at the stats. Like Jim Thorpe, he's a good card. Let's take a look at his stats. 95 speed, eh. 96 trucking, and 97 break tackle, though. Very, very good. 97 agility, 97 or 98 agility, 97 excel, 95 carry, 94 change of direction. This card's a great card. 95 speed's pretty good as well. And uh, this is a card you would want on the squad, if I'm being honest. So look out for stats. Make sure you look out for stats. And make sure you look out for price. You don't want to go and buy a 96 for 300, 400K. That's not what you should be doing. Make sure it's in like the 200K range. Make sure that that's like the deal there. So 96s and 97s and 98s and 99s. We're going to talk about the 90 from 88s to 94s. But let's talk about players you should be like investing in. And that is the 50 players, guys. We didn't get any 50 players this week, which I'm pretty shocked about, I believe, right? Jari Evans, no. Oh, Brett Favre. So let's go take a look at Brett Favre. He had a 93, I believe. I'm really not too sure. So let's go and take a look, Brett Favre. And yeah, I guess he had a 94. He had a 94, I'm pretty sure, right? 94, Brett Favre. 
No? All right, so we're just gonna take him off. Did I spell his name wrong? I'm, I probably spelled his name wrong, right? Yeah, all right, so I'm, I'm, I think it's like V-R-E, right? Isn't it like V-R-E? He has a weird, yeah, it is. All right, I was right. So V-R-E, maybe it is a 94, 93, I'm not sure, let's see. Might be a 94, might be a 90, all right, so it's a 93. It's a 93, we figured it out, guys. 93, Brett Favre, and he's going for, not, I was gonna say he's going for 63k. I was gonna say hop on that 168k, man. 168k. He's a 92 actually. I thought he was a 94, but 168k, guys. You can make big bank. Oh my god. I have coin method coming soon, guys. Coin method coming soon, boys. But um, you can make big bank off of this card if I'm being completely honest. So uh, get on it because you can make some good coins. So 92 Brett Favre is uh he like like i'm saying like you could invest in cards like like look at brett Favre. he was going for like 80k like three days ago and now he's at 168k I'm, I'm telling you guys investing is the moves go and invest in some 50 cards and it doesn't even if they don't come out the sunday the saturday you um <clears throat> you want it to come out you could still make coins like they could come out a week later two weeks later three weeks later who knows man but i'm telling you guys <clears throat> investing is the method my voice man I don't know what's going on with it. So, like I was saying, <clears throat> investing is the move. So, uh, yeah, those are the players who invest in 50 players. That's all I'm going to say. Invest in 50 players. And then training. I'm going to go with, yo, literally, guys, I'm going to tell you right now. Go to free agents. And you should only be buying free agency players, man. 15K for an 88. Where's Quentin Dunbar? <clears throat> Not Quentin Dunbar. Um, Marlon Mack, look at that. 18K. 3,600 training. Going by the 89 free agency players, I mean, it's the best players to buy. By far. I mean, it's the best players to buy by far. I mean, you're getting 3,600 training for 18K and uh, 15K basically for an 88 for 2,500. Either one works, to be honest, but I would go for the 3,600 for 18K. That's for sure. So those definitely work. Um, and and uh, 93 Jameis Winston is who I would go for. Let's go to QB. Depending on his price, it may have rose, it may have dropped. I'm not sure. I haven't looked in a while. Yeah, Jameis Winston I would go for unless Baker Mayfield is cheaper or somebody on that Brown squad. It's always Baker Mayfield. I don't know why. Let's take a look. Baker Mayfield's going for... All right, so same price, but I would stick with the free agencies. And uh, let's go take a look at the 94 overall free agents. Let's go back to free agency program. So training, I would go with, definitely go with an 89s, or you can go with the 93 James Winston, or you can go with the 94s, depending on the price of them right now. I'm really not sure what they are going for. Let's see, they're going for 121K. All right, so no 94s. Stick with the 93, stick with the 90, uh, the 89s and the 88s on the training. So stick with those. Time to talk about the 94s, the 88s, the 94s. So 88s, um, <clears throat> I wouldn't buy them for the squads, only for training. 88s, 89s, we're not even going to look at them. 90s, 91s, that's the same with there. I wouldn't even buy them for training. I would probably buy them just for like uh, power-ups and stuff like that. Maybe even... Um, 50 upgrades, that same 92s, 93s. They could be good 92s, 93s. Like Malik Hook, Hooker, let's take a look at his stats. 91 speed, yuck, 92 zone coverage, not bad. But the 91 speed doesn't cut it, he's gone. You're not supposed to be using a car like that. Um, let's take a look at, hmm, who else could we look at? I mean, now you know, honestly, all 92s to 93s don't work out in this day and age anymore. Re unless you're like just getting started, make sure you look at stats. 94s to 95s, you really gotta look at stats here. Very, very important. Like, let's take a look at uh, Trey Waynes, for example. Now, this 95 overall, 95 speed, 96 man coverage. This is a great card right here. 92 zone coverage as well. This is a good 95 overall, and he is worthy in a lineup. So, that, like, really just got to pay attention to stats, man. It's really all you got to pay attention to is stats. So, 94 to 95. And then, like I said, but, oh, well, that's actually pretty much it. So <laughs> I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Smash that like button and subscribe if you're new. Turn that notification bell and join the Naughty Gang. Coin Method coming soon on that Brett Favre. Also stream at 2 p.m. Eastern time. So uh, be there, be square. Pack opening. Thank you guys for watching. That's pretty much it. Peace.